Hi, I'm going to show you how to add contacts into your database in FlexMail. First of all, you'll need an Excel file with some contacts. I have an Excel file here. I have the email address, first name, last name, language, interest label, preference and source. Now this file needs to be saved as CSV UTF-8. And when we've done that, we can return to FlexMail. And we go to Contacts, All Contacts, Add Contacts. And here we can choose the file we want to add. Now in this screen you need to link your FlexMail fields with your Excel fields. Um, as you can see email address needs to be linked to email address, first name to last name, last name to name and so on. These are just the names that you put here on top of your columns. Now FlexMail will analyze your contacts to see if there are any contacts with broken data. 15 valid contacts, that's nice, we can finalize the import. And that's done. So now all your contacts are added to the database. Now if you want to edit or you want to update your Excel file uh, and your contacts into FlexMail you can just use the same file. FlexMail will always add the new information when you're uploading the same file uh, or when you're uploading, uh, uploading an updated file. Um, let's say we're going to add an interest label to this contact and to this contact and let's say we'll delete the interest label of Jerome Harrison. I'm going to save the file again. I'm going to rename it to be sure. Okay. Now I'm now I'm going back to FlexMail. I'm going to contacts, all contacts, add contacts. We're going to choose the right file. And as you can see here, selecting an existing file on your computer are allowed while updating existing contacts. will update, and as you can see here, select an existing file on your computer will update existing contacts with the most recent information. That means we'll only add the new information that will be uploaded. We will never delete information or overwrite the contact completely. We will always only add information. Um, if it's necessary. This is already correct from our last upload. Finalize import. So now we can do a little test. So Jerome Harrison, we deleted the interest label, so there shouldn't be any interest label when we look this contact up. So now that we are done, we can do the test. For example, Jerome Harrison, we deleted the interest label, but the interest label should still be there in FlexMail because FlexMail will never delete um, any data. It will just add the new data. If we open a contact, accessories is still there. For the other contacts, um, we added an interest label to this contact. If you're going to look it up, you'll see that the interest label is added. Shoes and clothing. And also for Jamie Hamilton, we added the interest label clothing if we're looking at the contact. We can see the interest label clothing is active. And this is the way to add contacts um, to FlexMail. 
if you still have any questions don't hesitate to contact us thank you